K-State Nation with Dave Womack, the defensive coordinator at Arkansas State. Coach Womack, the streak is over, but you knew going into that game, you thought this running back from FAU could be one of the best you faced. T- tell us what you thought and what you saw prior to the game and, and then what happened uh, on Saturday. Well, uh, you know, he's a big, powerful guy. I mean, he's 222 pounds, and uh, he's got the ability to move sideways, too. Shifty type guy. So uh, just a matter of time, he was going to have a breakout game. We did a really poor job of fitting him, to be honest to you. Uh, gave him some nice runs, but I, I really like him. I think he's a, a great running back. Got a chance to play in the NFL for sure. You made a comment earlier this week that he might be one of the best in the conference. Do you still think that after Saturday? <laughs> I think he's one of the best ones. I, I'll say that for sure. I mean, we got some good backs in this league, and there's no question he's uh, one of the top guys in the league, no doubt. Did the defensive take it personally uh, after the streak was over after the game, even though uh, you picked up the big win, the seventh win of the season? I think they were disappointed, you know. Uh, I think everybody made a bigger deal of the streak. Some of them didn't even know about it, I don't think, until I finally said something to them. I should have never said something to them last week about it. I think it got brought up in the media. So, uh, you know, I think we gave him up 136 total yards, but he had a nice day. He had like 163 himself, but we got lost yardage plays on the quarterback. But, uh, you know, winning the game is the most important thing. So there are some things we got to fix, though. How big is it to get that seventh win uh Coach Hugh Freeze, the first uh, head coach in the history of Arkansas State to get in, in his first season seven wins. Uh, how good is that to be a part of that? I think it's it's rewarding. I think he's done a great job of leading the team. Uh, you know, clear back to when we were doing off-season program early in the morning. I mean, he was building the foundation, foundation and plant the seeds right there. But, it, of course, you got to follow through with it. And uh, the players have done a great job. And, and so is the assistant coaches as well.